Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more updates. Topic for today's quiz is Corporate Accounting 2. Question number 1. Arrears of cumulative preference dividend is an example of liabilities. Option A. Current. Option B. Long term. Option C. Contingent. Option D. Fixed. The correct answer is Option A. Current. Question number 2. The process of law by which the corporate life of a company is terminated is known as Option A. Formation. Option B. Liquidation. Option C. Absorption. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Liquidation. Question number 3. Liquidation means of a company. Option A. Formation. Option B. Establishment. Option C. Winding up. Option D. Birth. The correct answer is Option C. Winding up. Question number 4. Winding up of a company by an order of the tribunal is known as winding up. Option A. Compulsory. Option B. Voluntary. Option C. Optional. Option D. Government. The correct answer is Option A. Compulsory. Question number 5. Winding up of a company by the creditors or members without any intervention of the tribunal is known as winding up. Option A. Compulsory. Option B. Voluntary. Option C. Optional. Option D. Creditors. The correct answer is Option B. Voluntary. Question number 6. The liquidator is responsible to appoint a committee of to assist him if the tribunal so directs. Option A. Members. Option B. Government. Option C. Court. Option D. Inspection. The correct answer is Option D. Inspection. Question number 7. In company liquidation the date up to which debenture interest is required to be paid depends upon the of the company. Option A. Solvency. Option B. Life. Option C. Existence. Option D. Incorporation. The correct answer is Option A. Solvency. Question number 8. Creditors include bills payable and less secured otherwise. Option A. Secured. Option B. Unsecured. Option C. Long term. Option D. Short term. The correct answer is Option B. Unsecured. Question number 9. The may order for the winding up of company if it thinks there are just and equitable grounds for doing so. Option A. Court. Option B. Tribunal. Option C. Creditor. Option D. Debtor. The correct answer is Option B. Tribunal. Question number 10. Government dues are called as creditors. Option A. Secured. Option B. Unsecured. Option C. Preferential. Option D. Non preferential. The correct answer is Option C. Preferential. Question number 11. Preferential creditors are in the nature of creditors. Option A. Secured. Option B. Unsecured. Option C. Long term. Option D. Fixed. The correct answer is Option B. Unsecured. Question number 12. The statement of must always be properly verified by an affidavit. Option A. Affairs. Option B. Liquidation. Option C. Dissolution. Option D. Court. The correct answer is Option A. Affairs. Question number 13. A company is said to be if it is in a position to pay all its creditors. Option A. Insolvent. Option B. Stable. Option C. Sound. Option D. Solvent. The correct answer is Option D. Solvent. Question number 14. 
there is no question of making further calls in case of shares option a partly paid up option b equity option c fully paid up option d preference the correct answer is option c fully paid up question number 15 the liquidator is paid for services rendered by him for completing winding up process option a commission option b remuneration option c lump sum amount option d fees the correct answer is option b remuneration thank you for watching the video if you'd like practice this quiz then download the wonder slate app now link in the description below if you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments if you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.